Hello and welcome, Paul here, and I'm playing Anno Domini 1257. Now, we are currently riding to a town or a city that we own, currently under attack. While I'm talking to him for some reason. Oh, no way! Archbishop Boniface of Canterbury has been paying court to Lady Isabella and you'll have to admit he's a finer catch for her than you so let's have no more talk of this shall we? I'm gonna have to uh... see if I can get my relation up with him quickly before it gets... before it's too late Okay, so I took this job, and uh, I'm hoping I've got some time to complete it. 30 days, that's not long. I can raise an army though, I'm not too worried about that until I can actually capture someone. We'll see. I've got business to attend to here first, I don't want to leave, so... Uh, they have 200 troops, 2,000 troops, we have... Why do I keep talking to him? We're just pouring on the troops now, okay. It should be good. Oh, Christ, why do I... Mist clicks all over the place. He's talking to me, what the hell? Or is it bugged? And it doesn't help that the map's so laggy. He's following me around. Okay, this is odd. I'm gonna have to help. Wow, we barely outnumber him. This is insane. Damn! Oh. I just caused the enemy to retreat. <laughs> Whoops. I wanted to get bolts. There we go. Oh my god, why is he bugging out? I need to help those people, but I can't click on it. Multiple battles. Alright, we outnumber them pretty heavily, but uh. So, after this, after we wipe out the forces of France, I can make my way down to... See, the Gaelic are fighting over around Scotland. I forgot they were at war, so that's why they're not fighting us yet. So if I can get up there and try and help one of the Scottish lords... And if this guy's still following me around and I can use him as well to help me in the battle, I'll bring that person, that uh, person back to him and that will be the quest complete, so... Anyway, I really like these crossbows, I gotta admit. It doesn't fire as fast, but... still pretty good. Plus I can reload it on the horse, this particular style, so... So alright, we're slowly moving down. Probably gonna charge eventually. I'm just gonna hang back. 
I've left my troops at base, now I need to bring them along. Oh, these are all the uh, the lords. Now oh, there's the archbishop, my nemesis. It's like a pretty old geezer as well, perverted man. I need a horse that looks like theirs. Maybe. All right, no more waiting around. I'm gonna lead the charge, just it. Because they're going to try and move in one go, and I'm going to stop them. Okay, maybe not. Anyway, fight's on. I need a faster horse though, that's for sure. I do need a lance for these type of cavalry battles, I think. Because you can just take one person out by charging them properly. Spears don't work as well. But then again, maybe that's what everyone's using, I'm not sure. Okay, down I go. I'm just going to back out. Order my troops to attack. We outnumber them pretty heavily, so we're not going to lose too many. Take some prisoners, nice. <laughs> wow. Maybe I should take these guys back to my manor and then set up a prison thing there. Probably wouldn't hurt. Battles won. More prisoners, that means I can sell them, make more money. And because we've taken out the bulk of the enemy force here in Par uh, here in France, I guess we can make our moves elsewhere. prisoners. I just turn up and like, alright troops, go help them out, fight's done, and then I get to actually take everyone prisoner, including the enemy lords. I don't know, it seems weird, but okay. Okay. And we saved our town, that's the other big thing. Quickly visit the tavern, see if there's a ransom broker. So yeah, every now and again you'll get these guys. And they sell just like helmets and stuff, it's weird. But there's no ransom broker here, sadly. But the arms dealer, anything good?
Okay, there's a lance. That's only 10. I'm going to take this and we'll see how it goes. Let's see how it goes. Okay, that guy's no longer following me, which is good. Because it was getting kind of annoying, moving like a tiny bit, and then he stops me to talk. No, he stops me to ask what I want, even though I didn't speak to him. God damn it! I thought I lost you. Okay, so... <laughs> Leave me alone, why is he bugged? Like, out of all the bugs to get, why have I got this one? <laughs> that worked. I told him to flee all the way back to his own town in Bristol. That is awesome. Now my luck is going to—he gets captured by the Gaelic Kingdom. Oh, that's funny. At least he got rid of him, though. That's a good way, good trick. Well, I imagine he'll eventually come back to me. Another prisoner. Plus I'm getting my relation up with that one guy quite high, which is good. He's also the Marshal, which is a big plus, but uh, yeah, having a supporter like that's going to be pretty useful in the future. And we're just rolling through France now, taking names. Honestly, I figured we'd have a harder time, but we seem to be doing okay. Oh, wrong way. 12,000 for the guy I just captured? Okay. I'll take the money. I mean, yes, we probably should keep him locked up because we're at war, but that's a lot of money to have and I can invest it. In the long term, it's certainly going to help out. We could just like lay siege to other places while we're here. Let's see if the king has any tasks for me. Follow him a little bit longer, see where we go, see who we attack, and then after that I need to head over to the Gale Kingdoms and try and capture someone. Easier said than done, however. Maybe we're heading back, or we're going to capture another place. I guess we're actually heading back. <laughs> I feel sorry for that guy. Kind of, not really. picked up so many prisoners. I just don't know what to do with them. Oh, 
Well, let's see where we go. I think we're heading back to England, to be honest, which is good. I've got stuff to do. <laughs> I like the naval fleet we have going on there. Okay, I guess we've turned in our attention to the Gaelics, which works quite well, to be honest. I'm going to use this time to quickly swing by my town. I do need to sell the items I've got. But I'll do that in a moment. Quickly check out Bridlington. Prosperity is getting there. I've got guards now, that's cool. Roof's a bit leaky. Oh, wait a minute, what's going on here? Nice. Okay, there's nothing actually in there. I'm assuming it's uh, just because my town's getting upgraded, maybe. I feel like I should build a prison, but I've got limited money. Alright, so I'll build that. I do have some money, so I can go ahead. And we'll also build a blacksmith, I suppose. And a winery. Let's go ahead and get it up. So that's going to be built. Let's have a look at the town. Oh, wow. <laughs> wow, wow, wow. So this is all walled off now. That is cool, man. This, is, this whole system is freaking cool. We've actually got houses built out of stone. And then we've got the marketplace here. And I guess I can go to each person. Oh, it's cool. This is cool, okay. Anyway, I need to sell some of these sl uh, slaves, um, <laughs> prisoners, because I don't really need to carry them around with me. Come on, town of York, do me a favour. Yes! Alright, so... Easy money. Okay. Question is, what do I do now? I might go over back to uh, Brindlington, see if I can recruit a few more people, then we'll catch up with everyone else, find out where they're going. I think I know where they're going, but I could be wrong. There's the guy who kept following me around, he's no longer doing that. Which is pretty good. Let's 
see if we can find this lord that I need to capture. Oh no! Damn it. Gotta stop it. It sets me back way too much if I don't. No, 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 no. Oh, thank you. Sir William, thank you, sir. Alright, let's kill these bastards. Got my lance at the ready. Oh, it broke already? Oh, bollocks, okay. Bad thing is they've all got faster horses than me. <laughs> oh dear. Come on, lose them in the trees, lose them in the trees. So we're just mopping them up.
He looked like the, uh, <laughs> the French guy from Monty Python, uh, Monty Python Holy Grail. He was on the battle. Did you see his moustache? His hat. Did look like him, I gotta say. I feel sad for killing him, but I think it happens. He's like the scariest man. Didn't help him now. Didn't help him. These guys are strong. What happens if I stop a mid raid like after it's smoking on fire? What will happen then? Damn, they got me. So one of my spearmen, okay. That's fine, that's fine. I think the fight's gonna be over before I can even get there. But as long as we defend Bridlington, that's all that matters. I just don't know why they went for my town after all the other towns that are out there. I mean, it's pretty deep in our territory if they're coming from France, but everything's pretty well unprotected right now, considering. got quite a few items. In fact, I might as well put those back. What I'll do, let my allies upgrade from them and then grab whatever items are left. The question is, did I turn up in time to actually save my town? It's on fire. I'm not entirely sure what that's gonna, what that means, but we'll see. Anyway, once I know that Bridlington's safe, I'm gonna head back over and capture someone from the Gaelic Kingdoms. Anyway, that's it for now. Thank you for watching, and join me next time.